I am in the kitchen with one of the most amazing chefs out there, the main woman herself, Gizzy Erskine. I'm a little bit overexcited because yeah. she's going to be teaching me how to cook. Gizzy, what are we making? We are making a marinated spiralised noodle salad. Um, and we're going to be serving that with satay sauce and also a really delicious crispy chicken. Sorry. Not good. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> to the avid vegetarian. It's fine, but I can deal with it as long as I can have the spiralised bit. Yeah, we'll save you a bit of the, the good bit. The good bit. Right. See, that is the good bit, yeah. right? Um, so listen, I'm going to start off, we're going to bung this all into a bowl, so I might as well make the dressing in the bowl. I've got some okay. palm sugar here, and so I'm going to get you to squeeze out as much juice yeah. as you can from that. Sure. We might go for another one. Um, and I'm going to put some Thai red chilies in here. I'm going for a really high quality fish sauce. This is naturally fermented, it's just fish and salt. So, okay. um, people say they hate the smell of it. I love the smell of fish sauce. I think that's completely weird, isn't it? Yeah, but didn't you like, like learn to cook in Asia? Yeah, so I maybe learned that's to cook why. in Thailand, so I think it's kind of, a, it is a bit nostalgic for me. Okay, and now, <laughs> Rehydrate it with some hot, hot boiling water. We're going to go for the noodles in three different sections. I've got daikon, which is this giant radish. Yeah. Um, sometimes it's called muli. It's got a peppery taste, but it's also quite watery. It holds onto flavour really well. Sweet potato. This is going to add sweetness to it. And then we've got some of the classic quagetti. Mm, I think you've got me a new obsession. What with your tamarind? Yeah. I love it. It's such a great I ingredient. haven't used it for ages, actually. Gently squidge it. I mean, what we're doing is we're marinating the noodles now. So, so we're, we're melting the coconut oil in there, and then I'm just going to fry off the curry paste. So this is a yellow curry paste. So I'm going to pop in some coconut milk. I've just got some chicken stock here. It looks like a cup of coffee. I'm going to squidge up some lime leaves. I'm going to pop in a good two tablespoons of this tamarind juice. I'm going to put some more of the sugar in. Then some fish sauce. Yep. So you put a couple of tablespoons of that in. The last thing to put in is four tablespoons of peanut butter. Okay. It's like a peanut curry. And uh, get some limes. Then I'm just going to get on and do the chicken. Okay. What I'm going to do now is simply coat this uh, chicken in some curry powder. And then salt. I'm just going to give that a rub around. It's like it's like almost like a dry rub. I'm going to start frying these off. They're going to get really nice and crisp on the outside. And then we'll finish our salad, serve up with the peanut sauce, and good to go. So another fantastic, healthy 20-minute meal to the table and brilliant for a dinner party or lunch or anything like that and great for the whole family. Um, I can't thank you enough. I've thank learned you. loads. It's again. amazing. And also, I've become obsessed with tamarind again, so yeah. that's great. Um, thank you for that. But remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos with me and Giz in the kitchen and head over to my website, honestlyhealthyfood.com, for delicious healthy recipes and all the blog posts on our day together in the kitchen and check out Gizzy's book which this recipe is from uh, Gizzy's Healthy Appetite. It is indeed. Thank you.